let's talk about it did you wonder about these have you seen these in the store just, i just wanted to bring that to y'all attention yeah nivea loxiton totally two different worlds but they look so much alike so you want to know which one i love better which one i recommend is it like kind of crazy how much these cost in comparison to each other keep watching y'all hey friends hey family it's your girl melissa q back with another video and today this is long awaited because i've been talking about this product for so long it's the nivea foam oil versus the loxiton Ooh, let me get it right the loxiton shower oil let's get to it i hope you guys are having a great day welcome back to my channel and thank you so much for watching if you're new i would love for you guys to hit the subscribe button before you leave but let's get into this review so i wanted to compare these two because i have loved for a while for a couple of years now the armand shower oil from la cita la cita you know the fragrance is amazing they have different sizes this is from province bronze you know this is the 16.9 they do have an eight ounce and they do have a travel size which i have had all three and this one retails i believe for 48 dollars and from the loxiton website and the let's see the eight ounce is 25 dollars and the 2.5 ounce is 950 very expensive okay so let's just talk about what the price for the 2.5 ounce is more than this Nivea? First of all, let's just uh, let's uh, the elephants in the room, y'all. Let's let's just address the uh, elephant, okay? Because he eating peanuts right now. This is 13.5 ounces for you can pick this up from Walmart, which is usually the lowest price. So I want to talk about the lowest price, but I pick up mine from CVS, and this retails for eight dollars from walmart you can get it for 7.98 you know how they do that 98 thing the difference is this one is an herbal spa scent which is really nice this one is my favorite which is the almond scent because i feel like nobody does almond like loxiton right but y'all <clears throat> oh let me drink some water because this price gonna make you drink some water okay 48 dollars For the same result that's rinsing down the sink Ooh. now i love luxury okay don't get me wrong but i feel like that this is a luxury on a budget y'all know i love luxury products i love them i, I talk about makeup i talk about hair care but y'all if luxiton is breaking the coins and y'all like listen i want to go on vacation i want to buy a handbag and you know what it doesn't this is going down the sink anyway it's not bringing any value to me besides you know don't get me wrong you can have a spa day but have it with this herbal spa scent it's not as nourishing this contains 60 percent oil now this is the only thing that i have about loxiton it doesn't tell on the website the ingredients but it does show on this bottle and this one does have grapeseed oil and it is the first Grapeseed oil is the first ingredient. This one right here, the first ingredient is soybean oil. Both of them are inexpensive oils, you guys. Hmm. Let me tell you something real quick. If they came out with different scents besides this herbal scent, Nivea would have it in the bag. Uh, really, there's no difference in feeling. I'm telling you, they foam up. Both of these are foaming oils. Y'all, the only difference that makes me want to purchase this is the scent, the almond scent, and that it has other things to layer. The only thing that the drugstore doesn't have is that almond scent that I love, but this is an herbal spa scent. Y'all, I can sacrifice. I don't know about y'all. This is my personal opinion, by the way, but I just wanted to bring you guys how much, how close these are in comparison, you know, $48 versus $8. $40 difference. Can you think about what you can do at $40? I'm just saying. This is not really like a personal review. I just wanted to come and show y'all the battle of, you know, luxury versus like drugstore and kind of give you like if you 
have always wanted to try this, try the Nivea first and then go and get this, okay? It's not even worth getting the 2.5 ounce. Why? For $9.50. I'm just saying. Get it on sale if you just really like this, but just know that there's an alternative. If you like foaming oils, if you have dry, dry skin, you can pick up this and pretty much get the same result. I'm just saying. Just the scents are different. I feel like I'm just I just wanted to bring that to y'all attention I hope you guys enjoyed this I just wanted to bring this information to the forefront and let y'all know luxury mmm L'Occitane you might need to bring down that price mmm cuz Nivea just I don't even want to say it's a dupe because it's not the same in scent but definitely the formulation of these are very very similar in terms of feel okay Okay. Thanks so much for watching, you guys. I'll see you in the next video. Bye, loves. Hey, mi gente. Don't forget to check out my last video. I know you guys will love it. Thanks so much, and don't forget to subscribe.